This is the kind of food that when someone tells me that they ate it, uh, my response is, you're gonna have diarrhea tomorrow. Hey, I'm Cameron. I'm Clint. Today we have the new triple cheese double bacon chili cheese fries from Wiener Schnitzel. Looks like the same amount of bacon to me. What is it triple the cheese of and double the bacon of? It is three slices of American cheese on top of chili cheese fries. And two pieces of bacon? <laughs> yeah, probably. If you were to tell me this product has triple cheese double bacon, I would be like, sign me up. Looking at it, this looks like the worst possible version of a triple cheese double bacon anything. I'd agree with that. In our experience of Wiener Schnitzel chili, it's like the lowest form of poverty chili. <laughs> you could poverty chili. Jeez, come on. All right, let's do it. Now I got some bacon flavor there, but I had quite a bit of bacon on that. Nice try, Wiener Schnitzel. Oh, However yeah. you decide to cover up your chili cheese fries, it's still gonna taste like that. That chili. Sorry chili you got on there. You know what this thing needs? Less chili? To go on top of the Papa John's pizza. Oh, you're right. So I got a good bacon flavor there. Yeah. Surprisingly good bacon flavor. Still the main flavor though is that chili. Mm -hmm. I guess there's people that need a fast food fix of chili cheese fries and you really can't get it anywhere else. You know what Wiener Schnitzel needs? Another place that makes chili cheese fries because they've got no competition. They can make it as bad as possible. That's why Walgreens always has such good deals is because Rite Aid always opens up right next to them. When companies compete, the consumer wins. Basic capitalism. The benefit is that the bacon is chewy, so once the chili has washed away, you're left with some chewy bacon and you get the flavor from that. I'll give this 12 out of 37. 13 out of 37. Thanks for joining in to the two minute reviews.